Our intrepid heroes have made light work of wasps, hey! bandits, hogs, hey! balberines, and even hey! undead. Hey! What's next? What could possibly pose a threat to our noble combatants? Hello, ladies and gentlemen, it's round six. The mighty Earth Trolls. <laughs> Look at that armor clip thing. <laughs> Sorry. Earth Trolls. Uh, we're gonna want multi air over this. And slow time. Yeah, slow time. So the strategy to dealing with trolls in the arena is basically to multi-arrow, then slow time. So you can take out at least one of the trolls. Of course that earth troll went down really quickly, and that one went down just as quickly. Let's go ahead and pick up the rubies. That was a very fast round! And, and we're gonna need some mana potions for this part. Wow, a total of 10,600 gold! Enough for a small house! Do they want another 8,000 gold? See, now the prize pools are getting good. So you're gonna get 8,000 out of this next one. Things are getting very tough for our contestants. We can all see that they're feeling the strain. But what stands between our noble heroes and their winning? Is that a pile of rubble? No, it's the Rock Trolls, Stanis and Groin! Now the Rock Troll round is a bit Three, more difficult. Two! One! Stanis, you big stung! Go! Boom! Stanis, you big stung! Yeah, I did too early. Crap. Okay, now it's counting. It's not doing a whole lot of damage. How the wisp just got decked in the face. Ugh. <laughs> oh, Alright, yeah, it's slow, slow time's gonna have to continue here. Yeah, multi arrows probably gonna need to get some use too. Oh shoot, went too far. Alright, see this is where the strategy comes into play more than more than the earth trolls. Just dealing with two trolls simultaneously is just it, it, it's a complete chore. So usually just slow time until you take out the first troll. And then you can take out the second troll easily. Uh, you can just take it out normally. Okay, that should not have hit me. Also, whispers distracting the troll. Good. Ow. That's not good. We're gonna need some multi arrows to speed this process up a bit. Ah, I moved a little bit too late there. Yeah, let's let it attack. There we go. Oh, how did that hit me? Alright, we're almost done. I'm surprised I didn't get I'm sur yeah, I'm surprised I didn't get hit there. Alright, this guy's one more arrow. There we go. Let's pick up this uh Ruby before I forget. And oh a health potion. Oh, wow! Another eight thousand gold! Eighteen thousand six hundred in the bag, and only one round to go. Yeah, we is still got dying for another ten thousand. Yeah, this is probably the archery part of the uh the <laughs> the arena. So this is where the scorn bow would have been very helpful if I had gotten it. You have seen the best of Albion's arena fighters. Also, something got red. For our successful heroes, but now. Round eight, the final battle. I give you Arachnox. Three, two, 
One. Go. Oh, right in front of me. That's convenient. So, the final battle with Arachnox. He has a charge attack. He has a charge attack that didn't hit me. And his uh, second attack basically charges up this little attack. You can get some good licks on him while he's doing this because he exposes his face. Then he burrows down and throws his tail out of the ground. So just move out of the way. It's a very simple move to dodge. Honestly, the charging attack is probably the harder one to dodge because sometimes the um, oh shoot, like can I cancel a lot of this? Yeah, I can. All right, so his third attack, he can spawn scorpions. So a spider scorpion, I think. I think that's what they call it, Arachnox. I mean, that would make sense. But it spawns other scorpions. Oh, it spawned back. I didn't think that was time. Ow. The traps are disabled, though. Huh. Alright. Ah. Get some good looks on this guy. So he has the three basic attacks. So he's not a terribly threatening opponent. Get some more multi arrow going. That was a bad shot. Okay. Got another good opportunity. Oh, he actually charged back into the ground. I always thought you had to kill all the scorpions before he pops back up, but I guess he just pops back up whenever he feels like it. Like right now. There he is. Don't do your charge attack. Oh. And luckily I was able to dodge it. Okay, probably two more arrows. Oh, call that one nicely. Let's go ahead and revitalize myself a little bit. And there we go! The arena bank is truly broken! That's another 10,000 gold! This is for a massive total of 28,600 gold! So yeah, you get a... that's the other benefit of the arena. You get a lot of gold out of this place. Incredible! So, what will happen? Two winners and only one prize? Well, as you know, we have a special guest here today. It's the one, the only, the hero of heroes, Jack of Blades! I have returned. After an eternity away from you all, Jack of Blades is back. I miss your original voice. This arena is all that is great in Albion, and you all that is worthy in it. I am honored to stand before you again. And I have a proposal to mark the occasion. One final round. A fight to the death between the two heroes still standing. The winner will receive a special prize. The loser will have the privilege of dying before you. What do they think they're doing? They can't do this. I don't know. I kind of like this idea. I'm going to put on a good fight. But I'm not killing you. I can't kill you. We came here to put on a good show. And that's what we're going to do. Let's go. So the, fi the true final round against Whisper. This isn't actually they're terribly hard of a round. It is essentially more or less the same whisper duels that you've been doing before. She does have a few new tricks though. Like Assassin Rush. Damn. You've improved since training. No shit. <laughs> she also tosses grenades. Which don't really do a whole lot since you can easily dodge them. But yeah, flourishes are gonna be your friend in this battle. Just like they always are. Come on. This isn't to the death. Uh, maybe for you. Come here. Uh, come here. There we go. 
We have a winner here tonight, folks! All he has to do is give her one final strike, and the bonus prize is his! But will he do it? Will he kill Whisper? Or will he throw his victory away? Don't do it, farm boy. We agreed. Just walk out. <laughs> I didn't agree to we dick. <laughs> Let's stop fighting now. Do -do -do. And right strike. A fight to the death it is, you bastard. So just like Twin Blade, my the evil option is to finish off a uh, whisper. And it starts up really m pretty much right where it left off, too. Also, it looks like we're going to be killing her in this corner. He's done it! We have a new arena champion! Let's hear it for the new conquering hero! By killing Whisper, this man has earned a bonus purse of 10,000 gold! Now that's the good part of killing Whisper. You get an extra 10,000 gold! Let's praise our new arena champion one more time! No more farm boy. It is kind of a sad scene though, I'll admit. Poor little Whisper. But my lady, he killed Whisper. He's nothing but a... Ah, Hi, there you are. The hero they're all talking about. I'm impressed. And that doesn't happen often. But I forget my manners. I am Lady Grey, the Mayor of Barstow. I can see you are a man of worth. You should pay me a visit at my Bowerstone North Manor. You murdered my sister. You'll die the slowest death. Thunder, I am tired of your protests and your petty squabbles. You cling on to past glories and ridiculous family ties like an old fool. As I was saying, hero, I do hope you will accept my invitation. We have much to discuss. Okay, bye Lady Grey. Hi, Thunder. You are a walking corpse. I shall never rest till Whisper is avenged. Take you right now. I can take you. <laughs> but unfortunately, we don't get to do anything else. After all that long battling, we're finally done. That was unbelievable. I haven't seen anything like it for a long time. I'll guide you back through the Hall of Heroes. You truly deserve to stand amongst them. I must say, you remind me of someone who fought here many years ago. Memory's not what it used to be, but I think her name was Scarlet Robe. That's right. Ever heard of her? Probably not. It was all before your time. But if you look on your right, you'll see her statue. She was the first female hero to become arena champion. She was a fine hero, just as soft-hearted as you. Yeah, soft-hearted. <laughs> After her final battle, she was never the same. She lives now in complete solitude, crushed by her failure to save her family long ago. And yet here you are. I knew her son would end up here one day. It's in your blood, and in your sister's too. You should bring her to me. I so long to reunite you both with your mother. Just think of the happiness it would bring her. This was the true face of his mother. Scarlet Robe, Slayer of Balverines. Once one of the fiercest heroes in all of Albion. Yet her most splendid battle was also to be her last. Ambushed by a dozen Balverines, Scarlet killed them all only to fall injured and drained beside their corpses. There she would have died but for Brom, a kind and simple woodsman who tended her back to health. In time they married and had two children, a girl and then a boy. Scarlet's days of death were forever behind her.
<laughs> that picture doesn't make much sense because it looks like the boy is eating the older. Just nitpicking. Whatever you decide, you've earned the champion seal. People everywhere will recognize you as the winner of the arena, and it will grant you access to Barriston North. Don't lose it. It is rather valuable. And after a rather chilling scene... And a loading screen. Quest complete. We get two trophies, the Champion Seal and the King Scorpion Stinger, as well as a boatload of money, experience, renown, and our boast. Show no mercy. Kill all your face. Also, we end it. Hey, you. Teresa wants you to meet her at the Grey House. Okay, bye Bandit. And that's gonna finally do it for this, guys. Yeah, so this yeah, is Galaxy cool 9. This has been Let's Play Fable but Anniversary. Dealt with Whisper. Yes, I yeah, dealt with Whisper man. very handily. In the next episode, going I'm gonna Attack try and do everyone. some nitpicky things, yeah. including those pesky Brad, temples, mostly. But, uh, I but yeah, I'm gonna save, take myself a well-deserved break, and, yeah, next episode, hopefully we can get some good goodies. So until then, guys, I will see you all later.